This kit contains everything needed to assemble a do-it-yourself simple alternator that generates two volts of alternating current and thereby illuminates a LED. Assembly takes about 45 minutes. The finished alternator demonstrates how kinetic energy, magnets, and copper wire form the basis of nearly all the electricity generated on Earth. The kit was designed by a science teacher to eliminate all the guesswork, frustration, and unknown variables that arise when building a do-it-yourself mini alternator. It's small, and students can assemble it within a normal lab period. Thus, teachers can readily incorporate it into their STEM curriculum. The do-it-yourself mini alternator kit comes with two magnet stacks, one spool of magnet wire, two alternator brackets, four bolts with wing nuts and spacers, a hand crank, two spacers, one LED, three strips of metal tape, and one piece of sandpaper. Insert the long end of the hand crank through the center hole of the back bracket. This bracket is labeled with a letter B. Note that the letter B should be located on the outside and bottom of the alternator. Peel off the adhesive cover on one magnet stack. Align a narrow edge of the magnet stack with the black indicator line on the hand crank and press down to stick the hand crank into the tape. Note that the hand crank is centered over the magnet stack. Peel off the adhesive cover on the long piece of metal tape. Center the tape lengthwise along the hand crank and then press the metal tape onto the white tape. The metal tape will cover the hand crank and partially cover the white tape. Place each spacer lengthwise on each side of the axle. Press each spacer into the white tape. Peel off the adhesive cover on the remaining magnet stack. Align the exposed tape directly above the first magnet stack and then press the two magnet stacks together. Insert the long end of the hand crank through the center hole of the front bracket. This bracket is labeled with a letter F. Note that the letter F should be located on the outside and bottom of the alternator. Complete the alternator's frame by inserting the four bolts through the back bracket, sliding them through their spacers, then inserting the bolts through the front bracket and securing them with wing nuts. The wing nuts should be positioned horizontally and made snug but not overly tight. Insert a pencil through the spool of magnet wire and situate the ends of the pencil between two heavy books so that the spool can spin freely. From inside the alternator, insert the end of the wire through the small hole on the left side of the front bracket. Pull about four inches of wire through the hole and then insert the wire through the same hole again. Pull the wire snug to lock it into place. Loosely wrap the end of the wire around one of the plastic spacers to get it out of the way. Wrap the entire spool of magnet wire around the alternator. Make sure that the wire is always wrapped within the lateral grooves of the brackets. The wire should be pulled snug, but not hard. This will take about half an hour and require a good deal of patience. You may inadvertently wrap the wire on the outside of the groove. If this happens, simply unwrap the wire to your error, reposition it within the groove, and continue. When you come to the end of the wire, insert the end through the hole near the groove on the right side of the front bracket. Pull the wire through the hole, and then insert the wire through the same hole again. Pull the wire snug to lock it into place. Pull both wire ends until they are outstretched from the front bracket, and then cut them to the same length with a pair of regular scissors. Scissors easily cut through the wire. The wire ends should be about two inches long. Fold the sandpaper in half with the rough side inside the fold. Gently drag each wire through the sandpaper, thereby stripping the enamel off the magnet wire and exposing the bright copper. Insert one LED prong into each of the two holes on the top edge of the front bracket. Gently bend the LED prongs out from the bracket. Wrap the left wire around the left LED prong and the right wire around the right LED prong. The magnet wire will twist around the LED prongs about 6 to 12 times. Peel off the adhesive cover on each short piece of metal tape and then secure the LED prongs to the front bracket. Your alternator is now complete. Illuminate the LED by twirling your index finger against the bent part of the hand crank. If you notice the magnets brushing up against the wire, simply push the wires away from the magnets. 
The magnets should rotate as close as possible to the magnet wire without touching the wire strands. 